find your way back home. Alright, what's going on everyone? It is Jack. So, a lot of news came out for The Walking Dead today. A lot. We have Maggie, gonna be coming back to the show. Princess was cast. So excited about that. Walking Dead was renewed for season 11. The trailer, or the first trailer, for the new show was released. And they claim we're going to be getting some Rick news. I'm not sure if we are. But if we do, make sure to keep an eye out for that. If they release like a trailer or anything for it, like an actual proper trailer, better believe I'm going to be reacting to that. So, I thought I would check out the trailer for the new Walking Dead series. I'm not sure what it's going to be called yet. We'll probably figure that out in time. Who knows? Maybe since I've recorded this, they've released the name for it. I don't know. But yeah. So without further ado, let's check this trailer out. It's called Monument Day. We should all monuments to the past. Nearly a decade after the start of the apocalypse. My dad is off laying the groundwork to change the world. Interesting. To someday, far in the future, get us back to where we were. It may take generations to regain the level of sophistication our science has given me. But my father has started the journey for us all. A generation born into the world. There are 9,671 people here. Holy this shit! Is your life. Pamela? You have to have seen enough to know what that means. This city's like ten times bigger and cooler than this place. So I'm gonna be gone by the time I'm old enough to decide to go see it by myself. We're gonna be gone. We are the masters of our fate. How do we form our fate? You really think the world's gonna end? You didn't want Dad to go. But he went, and now we may be in trouble. If we get there, I mean, what's gonna happen? If we get there, we'll be different. We'll be ready. Hmm. Why would you go for hope? That doesn't really look like apocalypse apparel, but I approve of the weapon, for sure. They're just going out into the world? Have they ever been in the apocalypse yeah, type of things? The world is start to finish. I don't intend to finish before I start. Don't. All of us feel the same way, man. scared every time. Oh, yeah. Every single time that you are outside those walls. Jesus. I need to make my life count. Wow. That's all I can do. Holy crap. This looks really good. Okay. Oh. I don't think that Walker's a big fan of that. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Side note if you haven't watched Stephen Lacey from Dual Reacts, they're doing a catch up series to The Walking Dead right now, and they're about to hit the season four finale. Go check them out. Okay. So. I feel like there was a lot of info in there. And actually, you know what? I'm going to go back. I'm going to look through it a little bit. Because I want to make sure... I'm Obviously, I'm going to watch it probably 10, 15, 20 more times. But I want to see if there's anything crazy in here that I can catch. Um, 
So there's there's over 9,000 people there, which is, I feel like is worth noting. Also worth noting. There's a lot of there's a lot of there's a lot of old people around. Not a, not a lot of that going on in the main the main series right now. It seemed like they they were either flashing back to college and track and stuff, or they actually have that going on right now. There's fighter jets going on and or going around at least. Here, I'm gonna take this off actually. We have a guy that seems to be the leader of this group. That is one of the main characters fathers it's basically going to be following a generation that was born into a dead world so the rjs of the world essentially and the henry's 9671 people this tell me this does not look like pamela from the commonwealth hold up okay so i feel like they were trying to tease us making georgie look like her but she's literally wearing almost the exact same outfit. Literally almost the exact same. Look at this. Come on. Even if you put them, put them side by side, just humor me. I get, I get that Georgie looked like her. I get it. But gray, kind of teal slash green, pearl necklace. Gray, kind of teal slash green, pearl necklace. Even... Even the pearl earrings. Oh my, this is, no. I'm not even, it's not even a question anymore. This is Pamela. Or this is the TV show equivalent of Pamela. There's no question about it. They went as far as to put the earrings in. Oh man, they are just throwing it in our face that that is her. Okay. All right, all right. It seems like it, it's going to be showing very not apocalyptic type things like things that kind of remind me of the beginning of fear but then also like apocalyptic stuff like a martial arts class you know there, there's a doc that's showing potentially some of the places where they pick up the letters how far would you go for hope i don't know you tell me how far people are willing to go for hope hold on a second Ooh, wait a minute. <gasps> okay. Okay. Tell me this does not look like the, the missing person board. I mean, it could just be like any old bulletin board, but that reminds me of the bulletin board that Michonne saw in the comics about her daughter. I was hoping they would do that in the show with Morgan and Dwayne and be like, oh, JK, Morgan was just crazy and people came and took his son and yeah, he's actually alive. But nope, they didn't. So brought him over to fear. But yeah, I mean, I'm sure there's tons of in-depth reviews of this already. So there's a lot of different weather, it looks like. This looks like either it's raining right now, or they're by the beach, or it's snowing. The walkers look extremely old. So it seems like we're going to be following these two. We're going to be following these three and the other kid. So those four kids. Uh, same guy. Looks like it, at least. Oh, gas mask walkers. Uh, all right, well, overall, I'd say that looks very promising. Now, we'll see how the execution goes. But we also heard the rings resemble or reference or are a nod to the fact that there are three communities working together. I'm assuming the Commonwealth. Um... This probably is going to be one of those communities. I'm pretty sure they mentioned that this was one of the communities. Uh, and then there's going to be another community. So, yeah. I don't know. I guess we shall see. I hopefully will be able to get my little podcast type video out that I did in collaboration with my girl, Mama Deadhead, Sarah. And make sure that you are here the second that you finish the episode for the season 10 premiere.
because my reaction will be up and ready. Don't worry. All right. Well, unless you have AMC Premiere, that is, then you're going to be finishing it like 15 or so minutes early, and I can't post it before the episode technically ends, so don't be there before, don't be there that early. Um, but yeah, so, hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you're excited for this new spinoff series. I think it could be good. I don't know if it would, I don't know if it can last as long as the main show, but I definitely think it could turn out really well. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, this has been Jack from Group of Gamers Inc. And I'm out. Peace. Thanks, bitch, beta. What is all of it? We're still running. Like some oh Roman God. shit. Tell him what's up. Jesus. Oh yeah. Is that Dante? Satellite is crashing down to Earth. Good Ooh. guy. Love it. No. Oh God, please. Mm. Oh come whoa, on, whoa, guys. Wait, what? The deer in season two is better than that. Come on.